Hey you, yeah you, this is Wack. I'm Lee. Also known as Wolverine, we're X-Men today. We're talking 1X from the folks at Bauer. Uh, if anyone's even seen the success of the 1S Odin line, this is basically an extension of that. Um, what are some of the biggest changes going on with the 1X line and what are your impressions of this stuff? I gotta say, I was a little timid checking this stuff out. Uh, you know, the 1S for me, very stiff, just not my style. I liked it, it was light, slid really well. Um, it was okay. So coming in, trying these out, I was a little weary, see what they did, yep. but uh, some really good improvements. Pleasantly surprised. Yeah, I think pleasantly we surprised. They thinned out the profile a little bit, so it's actually, uh, in terms of the balance, it's probably a little bit uh, better balanced. They've actually added two internal brakes inside the pad, so it's not so petrified up top. The rebound velocity is as we would expect, probably the liveliest, Just juiciest, biggest them. thing boots you'd ever them see. As far away as you can. Flies away, and you're gonna slide through plays. You will literally slide through a play. So in terms of your effort, just getting into a push and transitioning into it, you have to exert a lot less force moving into this stuff. Lee was flying through laterally, <laughs> east to west, nine to three. It's the one time I looked you're, fast. You're, you're faster than, he's Wolverine, <laughs> everybody. Um, so they've changed some of the things too on the back of the pad. They, it's, it, they've fine-tuned the strapping a little bit before you were kind of Betsy Ross weaving a flag back there. This is a much simpler, really nice change in terms yes. of where you allocate the strapping, where you want to feel that tension and where you don't. Uh, you're putting these things on in like 0.2 seconds. There's nothing to them. Um, it was nice because on ice, you know, first time throwing them on, you don't know what to expect. You don't know where to put tension and whatnot. So. It was easy, they, they, they're fine-tuned, you know, strapping. You literally just pull it up and down, it kind of moves with you. Yep. you, you can pick that perfect spot. Yep. I had an easy transition right out of the gate. Yep. They've added curved composite to some real notable points in the pad in terms of giving you better seal um, up and through with the knee into the thigh area. Um, but this line is really about speed. I mean, really, that's what it comes down to. Speed in terms of velocity of coming off the face of the pad in terms of where you're sending pucks, speed with your sliding, um, getting out of the room to go on home, to see <laughs> your family speed. Um, but the pads are super lightning quick um, and probably, in my opinion, an improvement from the 1S. Definitely. Uh, this might not sound like a big selling point to some, but they've changed the way they put a logo on a pad. To the little things. It's the elephant in the room. So they've had some adhesion problems in the past with the logos in the first iteration with the 1S line. They've addressed that now. It's an embossed, uh, slightly raised logo on the front. I think it looks a lot cleaner. Much cleaner. Um, no issues in terms of durability or longevity. Um, and it just kind of blends into the whole aesthetic of the pad, I think, a little bit cleaner. Thanks for checking out the video, guys. Be sure to check out more, all our social platforms, website, we're everywhere. Check us out. We're everywhere, pure goalie, check it out. For Lee and Wack, thanks for watching.